All right, folks. So let's round out this lesson on blogging as a content, uh, a type of content by talking a little bit about blog launches. All right. And the rest of this uh, certification in module, in the next module, we're going to be talking about traffic generation strategies to get eyeballs on your content. And uh, this is a perfect segue into the discussion about traffic because a blog launch is a couple of things that you really need to understand. Number one, a blog launch is an event. All right, it, it is an event. It has a beginning, it has an end, and it has a budget. Okay, so, and even if you don't have any money to allocate towards it, you do have a budget, okay? The budget is zero, all right? And you need to understand like how much money you can spend to to drive traffic to your blog during a blog launch. But what I want you to understand is that if you are going to rekindle an older blog that you have, or you're gonna start a new blog, you should have a launch. And that launch could be anywhere from, you know, three days to maybe a week, uh, max 10 days, right? Where you're really, really driving traffic to that blog. You might, you might burn through a larger budget to try to really get that blog, uh, rolling forward. And, you know, it's sort of very similar to the greased shoot that we were talking about. Um, when we talked about getting people to pull down the page, in an earlier uh, video, it's very similar here where you've got to take this blog that really is sort of at a resting state and get it rolling down the hill, get that boulder to move. And um, you do that by putting a beginning and end date on a calendar and allocating a budget towards, you know, really pushing hard on getting traffic to your blog. So the big thing I want to leave you with in this video about about launching a blog is that uh, there are a number of traffic strategies that we're going to cover in the next uh, few videos to end the certification. And um, the ones that are more organic, the ones like SEO and uh, social media marketing, things like that, um, these things are not launch strategies. All right. Unless you have already built up huge social media lists that you can sort of hit all at one time and, and drive a lot of act activity, uh, social media is not a launch strategy uh, or a launch traffic tactic. It just takes too long. Search engine optimization takes too long to be a launch strategy or a launch tactic, uh, you know, to use to put lots of eyeballs on your blog all at once. So, um, you know, while, while the things I'm going to teach you about social, uh, social media marketing and the things we're going to talk about, about SEO are certainly important and you should be doing them. They are a long term strategy that pays off over time. Whereas some of the things I'm going to talk about when it comes to paid traffic and, you know, cutting a check can be really fast burn. But of course, they're sort of like eyeglasses, right? Paid traffic is very similar to eyeglasses. When you take the eyeglasses off, they stop working. Okay. And when you put them back on, they work. Okay. It's just like that with paid traffic. When you turn paid tra traffic off, it stops working. Okay. Now, when you couple paid traffic with great content, you can see a lasting effect though. You know, you can bring people to your content and they can subscribe and move into the middle of the funnel and start to receive more content and, and, and be brought back over and over and over again to your blog. Um, so, uh, but the big thing to understand with, when we talk about these blog launches is that this should be something where you put you put two dates on the calendar and you, and you take a budget and you say, okay, we're going to launch this blog for this period of time. We're going to put traffic on this blog. And in the next set of videos, we're going to be talking about those traffic strategies that we use to get content, uh, in front of the right people. We'll see you there.